daily challenge is to run a mile. So I'm running around camp. The griefing has gone up. I made a video uh, just a few days ago about the griefing going up. Yeah, I went to uh, Valentine, got griefed, had to report a player for stalking me, literally camping outside while I bought moonshine ingredients in the town of Valentine right there in the shop. And this person, I'm not going to say their name, I'm still waiting to ed the, edit the video. I'm not sure how to edit it because I don't want to include their name in the editor. But at the same time, uh, you know, long story short, uh, my editor is not the best. But it's free. So there's that conflict. But yeah, griefing has gone up. I was just in Strawberry. And there was a person camping at the fast travel, lassoing people out of the safe zone into that river right there in Strawberry and trying to just drag them down the river. And I think there was a van down by it too. Um, griefing has gone up. The hostility has gone up. But that's just natural when the player base increases because sales are up because this game is great. Why shouldn't they be? Yeah, seems like a real good idea to abandon it. Yeah, sarcasm. A little bit of sarcasm there. Not. Not a good idea to abandon a game where the sales are up. So they abandoned this game um, a year ago. Just see ya. Yeah, we're just going to abandon the greatest game ever made. It makes total sense. So then now, the sales are up. This game is great because it is, you know. Griefing has gone up. A thousand percent. Because there's a lot of toxic players. And I still have not run a mile yet. So I hope you're enjoying this video. It's just me running around talking. And believe it or not, I only had to run a half a mile because I already ran about half the distance before I made this video. And it seems like it takes forever. And it does. You know, I've had challenges where we have to run 500 feet, but this time it's 10 times the amount. Or was that, was that lead our horse 500 feet and run about half this distance? Boy, I think they're making us work off all of that holiday food for our characters. They're a little bit, um, yeah. And there it is, 5,280 feet. It's only $10 today. I mean, I mean, not $10, uh, 10% of a gold bar. That's all right. Kind of missed a couple days here and there. Have a good day. Griefing has gone up. Griefing has gone way up. I'm telling you. Why is this? Well, I got you know what I think it is, and um, can't really get mad about it. They're from GTA 5. They're from the GTA toxic culture. What do I mean by that? As soon as they see somebody, they just have to shoot them. In this game, not in real life. As soon as they see them, they have to engage them. And they have to. the best way to engage them is this way. Not saying, not using emotes. Just like, hello, how's it going? I just wanted to say hi. Nope, that's not how you say hi. That's that's how you do it in GTA. I, you know, here in Red Dead, that, that, that just makes peer players jump the lobby. And they don't want anything to do with you. So if you want to really meet new players. Oh, and, and camping at Fast Travels. Do that enough and you will get permanently banned. But I don't know about that because this game's been abandoned. They said, I don't even know if we've got any technical support. So I don't even know if that's even going to do anything. It's, this game is truly getting corrupted and turning into a disgusting puke bag of toxic players that all they want to do is play toxic PvP where they camp at fast travels they just camp in town they wait for the player and then they rush them and you can see them coming at you like a hungry animal like a hungry predator that hasn't eaten in 500 days and if they don't eat today they're dead yeah they've been starving for that long it's, it's some ridiculous rage that they have that they must pursue and then when you don't engage them because you want to reach your destination, they just keep coming at you. It's it's gross behavior. All they want you to, all, and okay. 
Anybody below level 30 in this game, beware of. They're most likely 100% a sweater. Stalkers. Stalker sweaters is what they are. They stalk you and they sweat you. It should be a bannable offense in my opinion. But there's no there's no customer support. Or is there? There's customer support. I mean, I mean there's no... I don't think there's any kind of support. They, they really just abandoned this game. Left it to rot. Even though the sales are up. It doesn't make any sense to abandon it and it this game really this game really has turned into the wild west <laughs>